The program Héroes del Mar is about kids, teaching them how to take advantage of their resources. We want to see the kids take ownership of what's theirs, but in order for them to do this, they need to have the tools, and that's what we're here for. We're here to teach them, to educate them, so that they can be the best that they can be, to empower them. That's our mission. The villages that we chose are in very remote areas. A lot of these kids never have been away from home. They've never been out of these villages. We need to expose them to what's out there so that they can appreciate what they have. The areas they live in are incredible. The islands that they have, what's in their front yard, and unfortunately, sometimes they don't see it, they don't recognize it and you have people that come from other places and they see all the opportunities and, and they buy the property from the fishermen at a very low price and they are able to exploit them and, and develop them. We want to equip these children so that they can make good decisions. We take the kids out to sea for eight days and we immerse them. It's an intense program. We've gone hiking, they've kayaked, they've snorkeled. We've been able to go to mangroves. We've been able to do some bird watching. We've brought a scientist on board who is able to work with them. They relate to this person and they're able to identify. So these kids who have never in their life thought of being scientists work side by side with the scientist and think this is something that I can do. We also brought aboard an economist and uh, he has brought to them the possibilities of being an entrepreneur. They've sat down and they've done flyers and they've done presentations where they've taken ownership of the places that they're from as though they are developing a business in their home. Also, we've talked to them about tourism. We've talked about sustainability and fishing reserves. So if they're gonna be fishermen, that they be fishermen with good fishing practices. The experience has to be intense. There's no other way to show them all the possibilities of the Sea of Cortez if we don't immerse them in this life-altering experience. And they need to have this experience so that they can turn the chip, which was one of the primary reasons that we decided that it needed to be done on a liveaboard. Ahí como trabajamos en el barco, cada quien emprendió su lo que le gustaría hacer y a mí me gustaría construir un restaurante donde puedan llegar muchos muchos turistas porque me, hoy me quedé emocionado y con esas ganas de llegar a Limí y contar lo que lo que hicimos lo que lo que viví realmente estos siete días me di cuenta que el programa Héroes del Mar te está abriendo las puertas a ti para tu futuro te hace despertar de la importancia de todo de todo lo que hay a nuestro alrededor de todo lo que tenemos no solo están enseñando a jóvenes, sino que están enseñando a próximos empresarios o die master o geólogos, conocimientos que nunca en una escuela te van a enseñar si no lo vives. A mí este viaje me ayudó a ver todo lo bonito que había en mi comunidad. También la verdad yo lo había visto, pero no lo había visto de esta forma como ahora lo ve. They've been so busy and I feel that each and every one of them is eager to return in the next two years. This is a three-year program with the intentions of having them be in a mentorship program by the third year where they can help the next generations to follow. For conservation to be successful in Mexico, it's imperative for the communities to be involved. The community has to benefit we want to help the kids by giving them tools and guidance so they can develop these communities. Because at the end of the day, if they can live from their natural resources, they become the guardians.